Good morning, Johnson Learning Leopards. Today is Thursday, January 7th. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for the moment of silence on level zero. All right, guys, since we are having our school-wide morning meeting tomorrow morning, I'm going to go ahead and share the birthdays for today and tomorrow and the weekend. So here they are. Miss Isabel Firo, Miss Malia Johnson, Mr. Jacob Kosmachko, and Mr. Troy. Happy birthday to all of you. We hope you have a super awesome and fun birthday. And we will be announcing our next round of Responsible Leopard Leaders on Monday. Um, and now please join me in reciting the Johnson Code of Conduct. As a Johnson Learning Leopard, I come to learn. I promise to roar by being respectful, open-minded, actively engaged, and responsible. I will always try my best. All right, news you can use. Like I said, tomorrow is going to be our school-wide morning meeting, so make sure that you tune in tomorrow at 9.30 for your morning meeting with your teacher, and then your teacher will connect you with that school-wide morning meeting. As always, we've got lots of fun things planned, so I think you will enjoy that. And today, I cannot even make up the days that they have out there. Today is National Argyle Day. Now, that might be a new word for you, so I'm going to show you what it means, okay? It refers to this pattern on these socks. Have you guys seen socks like this or a pattern like this? So this particular pattern is called Argyle, and it came from Scotland in the 1600s. So look more closely. What shapes do you see in this Argyle pattern? It's a little bit tricky to see, but it's actually made up of overlapping diamonds, which mathematicians would call rhombi. And I definitely own my own pair of argyle socks. And when I get home today, I'm going to put them on for National Argyle Day. All right, today's joke comes from Leslie Cruz in Miss Case's class. What did the corn call his dad? What did the corn call his dad? Popcorn, of course. Great joke, Leslie. Thank you so much for sharing. Um, and that's all I've got. I hope you guys have a thrilling Thursday and think about how you can roar today at your house or wherever you are. We love you and we hope you have a wonderful Thursday.